Here's our uh, 2006 Aston Martin V8 Vantage. Finished in titanium silver and the colour is something else, honestly. It's beautiful. Lovely sparkle to it. You can't really uh, see it properly unless it's in person. It's just absolutely lovely. And this car's done 2,700 miles. And it's been extremely well kept. As you can imagine, take a look at the wheels for instance. All clean. Even the discs around there are all tidy. What I'll do is I'll run you uh, around the outside and show you the interior boot and bonnet then take it for a drive. Oh, this thing is just absolutely lovely from, from all angles really. It's just beautiful. I wonder how many times I'm going to say the word beautiful. That is the best word that describes this car. Parking sensors at the back. Same again at the back, it's all uh, clean. We haven't cleaned the car as such, we've, all we've done is brought the car in and uh, it's as it is really. So we didn't clean the wheels, they just that's how it came into us. I can only imagine the car was stored in the garage for uh, most of its life. I uh, show you the uh, interior. Door trim is all okay. So the seats, I mean the seats are like new. You've got these plaques either side um, and one on the engine bay which I'll show you soon. Interior is all nice. You've got no markings on the interior, guys. It's a brand new car, basically. It's um, from the way it looks, of course. It's headlining is all good. It's got the uh, suede or Alcantara headlining. This one is a manual, which I prefer personally go around the other side now. There we go. I hope I'm not going too quickly on this video. I'm just trying to uh, show you as much as I can without taking too long. It's sometimes hard to judge if I'm going too quickly or too slowly. Same again. Levels all good. The whole interior is lovely. Another plaque, same again as the other side. Handbrake levers all okay. Seats are all nice again, the other side. Some room for shopping bags or a few small luggages in the back, suitcases if you like. It's a screen that flips up. So I'll now quickly show you the back while I'm here. Then I'll start the engine up. Press the button here. Ooh, there we go, it's focused now.
Same again, the carpet up here is all okay. Even around here is all clean. We haven't cleaned this at all. This is how it came into us. So yeah, very, very clean. I'm now gonna start up the engine. Wait for the lorry to go. That way you uh, can hear it on start up. Key in, ignition on, then the uh, magic button. The screen flips up. These uh, screens aren't flickering in real life, it's just down to the re uh, recording. You've also got a clock. I'll go around to the back of the exhaust just so you can hear the engine note or the exhaust note rather. Now we're uh, out on the road. Um, just thought I'd do a few minutes just driving just so you uh, can all see how well it drives. So like I've said, it's got a V8 uh, petrol engine, naturally aspirated, and it produces 380 brake horsepower. The car's done 2,754 miles. Drives like new, as you'd expect. I mean, even Aston Martins that do 50, 60 plus thousand miles they still drive as they came out of the uh, factory. Six speed manual gearbox, but nice gear changes. It's nice to have a manual in an Aston Martin because some of them are automatics. Even the uh, indicator noise is nice. It's got a nice click to it, nice tone. Steering wheel is, feels new. It's got a nice weight to it as well. Even the feel of it is nice, like I've said. Driving on the, on the country roads is just very pleasant. The ride is very settled. Just a nice place to be in. It's it feels premium and high quality in here. Like I've said, the dash is all, it's never been even touched. No one's, there's no fingerprint marks, no scratches, no tears in the leather from what I can see. It's a lovely car to drive, it honestly is. Turn the temperature down. It's quite a sunny day in uh, England at the moment, which is uh, rather unusual. Put my foot down just a bit. Got the V8. It's lovely. It's a nice tone to it. Got a nice roar, and it's nice. This uh, the Aston Martins in general are British, British made, handmade rather, by someone signed on the plaque. Honestly, it's a gorgeous car to drive. And even looking at it, you haven't got to drive it to enjoy. You can look at it and just enjoy, enjoy the look of it. It's just got a nice stance to it. it this sort of um, era of Aston Martin dates very well. It looks classy and it looks modern. In a way, it also looks quite old. And it just, this era of Aston Martin, I like the most. But now the designing of the cars. Instrument class is all nice. It's a classic analog dial with the opposite of rack counter going up that way. I'm sure you've seen from the pictures on our website or wherever you've seen the uh, advert on this car. Brakes feel sharp, very sharp actually. Going around the corner, it's nice. Whack it down the gear. Got oh, very nice exhaust tone to it. Lovely car. What else can I say? It's a lovely car to drive. Who doesn't love an Aston Martin? I'm pretty sure every British person loves an Aston Martin. But yeah, beautiful. Can I find anything wrong with this car? No, not at all. I don't own it. That's what, that's what I can find wrong with the car. It's not mine. <laughs> um, but I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, gave you an idea what it's like to drive. Just thought I'd take you out. And, so you can see for those of you that live uh, far away, we do offer delivery around the country or you can collect it from our showroom in uh, Hutton, Brentwood in Essex. Our postcode is CM131TJ. Um, info at fairmontsportsandclassics.com is our email address, or feel free to follow us on our social media. All our handles or links are in the description below. And our phone number is 01277 
561 and uh, we look forward to uh, seeing you. Thank you.